We just saw Jupiter Ascending, starring Channing Tatum and Myla Kunis. Uh, I liked it a lot, actually. I, it was very, it's gotten very poor reviews, and I thought it was actually very good, very inventive, very creative, really interesting. Uh, it's not a perfect film by any stretch of the imagination, but I, I thought it was very entertaining. Um, it, it, it's uh, got Sean Bean is also in the film, and he's great. He, he's probably the best part of the movie. Channing Tatum and Myla Kunis are very beautiful people, and they're very easy to look at. And they do a fine job with the material, but I, I don't think not either of them are standouts in particular. Pretty much everybody else is a better actor in the movie than them. But even <laughs> still, I very like it. The Wachowskis really are creative people and really do great things and really creative things. Like... This reminds me of The Matrix in as much as it's just something new and I've never seen before. Like I've never seen I've never seen anything really like The Matrix. It had its roots and other things, and so does this, but I've never seen anything like this before. So I, I really liked it. I thought it was it was a very solid film and I would recommend people seeing it. I give it a solid eighty out of a hundred. very decent film. And what'd you think? Alrighty. Hi all. So, I I actually liked it as well. Um, I so okay. Let, let's start with what I liked. I liked some of the story beats and um, some of the philosophical questions that the film raised. Believe it or not, they raised some philosophical questions. Definitely. Um, visually, I thought it was incredibly interesting, unique to look at, and they bring it every time. You know the the Wachowskis. Wachowskis or whatever, however you pronounce the name, they bring it every time, you know, even Speed Racer, which was one of their films that was... I did not like Speed Racer. You didn't Racer. like, I like Speed Racer, even though it was, like, silly. Um, now, that being said, you know, at one point I thought I was going to fall asleep in this movie, because the action was just so, it was so much action. Just It was, there was. And it was like, oh, okay, okay, another space battle. But, all that being, and here's the thing, so... Channing Tatum and Mila Kunis are supposed to have like this thing and for me their chemistry was hit and miss yeah, it was no, not, they're, they're not a ton of chemistry for the, them. the chemistry was just not there for me with them I, I didn't really buy like why she liked him so much and I could sort of get like why he liked her um, his character was a little bit muddled but anyway and then a lot of stuff was right on the nose you know Sean Bean is in it and he plays a character who's part B and his name is Stinger do you know <laughs> so it's, it's just like it's a little corny and then there's some lines in it that are like almost like 80s action movie but corny you know like you know corny action lines and, and there's a predictable nature to the entirety of the story and there's some unbelievable things that the characters character choices and things that happen now all that being said well you know, what do you go to the movies for? You know, you want to see a spectacle, you want to see visual effects like artistry, that's in this movie. Uh, you want to see something original and inventive, that is in this movie. So, I mean, I would say if you wanted to see it from the trailer, you should see it in the theater. And I'm gonna give it a 75. And, uh, and and that's just for all the things I said, you know, the visual originality, the uh, some interesting things that are said in the movie. Don't I mean? Don't go see this movie to go see like a, a great romance. Yeah, a it great is not romance, a or, great romance. Or, Their chemistry is very or a great drama. I mean, you're just going to no. see a bunch of action. You know, it so, is an action movie through and through. But um, you know. I, I'm looking forward to see what they do next, and uh, thanks for watching the video. I love you. Rate and subscribe, and uh, see you soon.